Hi, we are in the studio today with guitarist Pat Bergeson. Uh, Pat, you moved from Illinois to Nashville at Chet Atkins' request. That doesn't happen every day. Um, besides working with Chet Atkins, he's also recorded and performed with artists such as Lyle Lovett, Susie Boggess, Madeline Peru, Jerry Reed. Um, you also play mandolin and harmonica, I do believe. Yes, I'm uh, uh, mainly harmonica, okay. mandolin a little bit, but Very mostly cool. harmonica and guitar. Mm -hmm. Well, Pat, um, tell us how you got started playing music. Uh, I got started playing music by playing drums in hmm. in uh, band in, okay. uh, when I was a kid, about third grade, mm -hmm. and I played all through grade school, junior high and high school, played band and orchestra and played okay. percussion and drum set and all that. And, and uh, then I got started on guitar when I was about in... Uh, Early high school, okay. junior high, you know, and um, bought my first uh, electric guitar, a Honer Les Paul mm. copy, <laughs> when I was about 14. Okay. And, uh, and that's when I started getting serious about it, about freshman in high school. <laughs> school for music? Uh, yes, I did. I, um, I went to music camp in the summers uh, mm -hmm. for percussion and drums when I was in grade school mm -hmm. and through high school. And then uh, I went to uh, uh, University of Illinois yeah. and I was studying composition and um, uh, classical guitar performance. Cool. And then I transferred to William Patterson University mm -hmm. in uh, New Jersey. Mm -hmm. And um, was studying uh, jazz guitar, and I got a, a degree in jazz studies from there, and um, and I stayed in New York for about ten years. That's great. Yeah. Well, we had mentioned Chet Atkins. Tell us how you got hooked up with that. Uh, a, a songwriter friend of mine named uh, uh, Robert Lee Castleman mm -hmm. um, gave Chet Atkins a demo tape of a song oh. that he recorded and wrote, and I played on the demo. Mm -hmm. And um, Chet actually uh, ended up recording that song on a record with Jerry Reed called Sneaking Around. Yeah. And, and it was the title track, Sneaking Around. And Chet had asked... Uh, uh, Robert Lee Castleman, who was that guitar player playing on the demo mm -hmm. tape, and and not long after that, I made a trip to Nashville, and he heard I was in town and wanted to meet me, mm -hmm. and so I came down to his office and hung out with him for the day. Cool. And several months later, he called me uh, to play on a record with him and Jerry Reed, mm -hmm. that the record sneaking around, and so I played on the record and. Uh, about a year later, I moved to Nashville, and wow. he kind of took me under his wing and helped me out just greatly, and I ended up playing in his band for about eight years. That's wonderful. And did a few records with him and wrote songs with him. Hmm. And, and uh, yeah, it was a really great, great, fantastic experience. I bet. Yeah, really. Good. Well, Pat, you are a multi-instrumentalist. Um, tell us about how um, that has opened up more opportunities for you as a musician. Well, uh, playing um, harmonica as well as guitar, mm -hmm. it, it's really helped me a lot in session work. Mm. Because if you just bring um, 
extra instruments yeah. to a session, you know, there's a, very often that somebody will say, hey, Pat, will you uh, put a harmonica solo on this or sure. put a rhythm harmonica part on there? Mm -hmm. and, um, and, uh, and then I also do jazz harmonica. Cool. And so that really has helped a lot. You know, it's really doubled the amount of work that I've, That's I've nice. gotten. You know, and I play a little bit of mandolin, but I, you know, I don't do that much on <laughs> sessions. You know, there's too many good mandolin players right. in Nashville, so... But yeah, it's really helped me a lot. That's great. I would also like to mention that I have a DVD out on Mel Bay. It is entitled Contemporary Improvisation, and it's two and a half hours long. I hope you enjoy it. Here's a lick over an A7 chord. Okay, and the way that I do that is um, the first three notes are a pickup, and then uh, beat one is on the pinky finger here. So it's slowly, I'll play it like this. Well, Pat, tell us about um, some of the things that are coming up for you. Um, well, let's see. Um, I've been currently have been out touring with Susie Boggess mm. as one third of a of a, the Susie Boggess trio. Nice. She's fabulous, and and I really have a great time working yeah. with her. And and um, we go all around the country playing um, small theaters, and mm. and we'll be in Italy in April uh, doing a guitar festival there, and. Um, and I've, I'll be doing that some this year, mm -hmm. and I'll also be doing some touring with my wife, Annie Selleck. Yeah. Also, uh, I'm currently working on a uh, record, a, a guitar record, mm -hmm. and uh, I'd like to finish another guitar record. Um, I have one record out uh, that I did. It's called uh, Country Gentleman, a yeah. Tribute to Chet Atkins, mm -hmm. and um, uh, that I kind of did my version of Chet Atkins cool. style guitar, and, and um, I have a record called Hippie Dance, which features <laughs> my harmonica playing a lot nice. in that, on that record. And, um, uh, Annie and I are, are actually currently working on a record as well. Oh, so, cool. um, but yeah, I'll I'll be doing session work and and doing some touring and some producing and nice. and um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this next year. Staying busy. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you so much for taking the time uh, to talk with us today. Thanks for having me. <laughs>